Uh, we've made it to the end of March and it's been a very, very busy summer period. You think about heat waves, you think about fires, you think about the challenges of being prepared for what was a season we predicted to be very busy. I'm very pleased today to have with me all of the Chiefs, the Chief Fire Officers, um, the Chief of SES, to just say thank you to everyone in the sense that it's been a busy time and our involvement with so many people is so important and we value everyone's contribution. It's about those that are on the back of fire trucks, it's about those that are in municipalities working to get all that coordination happening. Those in the agencies that sometimes are beavering away at issues that are so detailed and don't always get the opportunity to be thanked. So we say thank you to everyone that's been involved. Also the Victorian community is a key part of it. People have tuned into these little videos every week to get the latest update. And no matter where you are, the fact that we can get information out in a really timely way has been one of those critical things that I think has been valued. And I'd like to say thank you for you as a viewer um, in listening to us tell the story about what the fire season's meant to us and more importantly to you. So I'll hand over to the Chiefs and let them say thank you. Um, and there's some really important words that we should all um, take time to dwell on, respect and understand the words we're saying. So thank you. 2013-14 fire season has been very busy. Started in October with support to New South Wales and then during both January and February significant lightning fires and lots and lots of small fires which were kept small by the determined efforts of the Victorian fire services. On behalf of all of the fire chiefs and the fire services commissioner, I just want to add my sincere thanks to everyone who has been involved. At the start of the fire season, we reinforced the importance of messaging and protecting the community. We reinforced the need to work as one. And in reviewing our efforts over the fire season, we can all be jointly very satisfied with the outcome. We've seen some long duration forest fires, particularly in Gippsland. We've seen the Hazelwood Mine fire. Uh, we've seen support from uh, many states and New Zealand uh, into Victoria this year. And I think everyone has performed absolutely magnificently. I just want to, in closing this off, reinforce the importance of your individual effort. No matter how small your role has been, no matter which agency uh, you have been working for, uh, your effort has made a difference in protecting the community of Victoria, our critical infrastructure and our public assets. Uh, you've made a great difference and a great effort. Thank you sincerely. Job well done. I'd just like to uh, offer my sincere thanks to everyone in emergency management in Victoria for their outstanding efforts over what has been a very long and difficult bushfire season uh, with the added complexity of a fire in the Morwell Open Cut at Hazelwood. Uh, in particular, I'd like to acknowledge the volunteers who have uh, kept up their commitment right throughout uh, the bushfire season. Uh, a special thanks to the SES volunteers for the vital role they've played uh, in supporting staging areas, uh, logistics and ground support, and also conveying messages to the community and supporting evacuation management. Uh, this work is quite important and uh, has been vital in assisting the fire agencies to do their job. Thank you. I just want to say a really big thank you to all the DEPI, Parks Victoria, Melbourne Water and Vic Forest staff that have attended fires this year. It has been over 800 fires across the state. And we know we started early in the season with fires in the, in the Mallee and the Grampians. And then of course, the work that's gone into the fires in Far East Gippsland, plus many other fires across the state where we've either led or supported the other fire agencies. It's been quite a big effort. We've also uh, spent quite a lot of time with people in incident management teams at the Morwell Fire, a fire that heavily affected uh, central Gippsland. So it's uh, with a sincere thanks on behalf of all the other agencies and the Fire Services Commissioner that I say uh, a really good effort from, from everybody from across the state to contribute to helping make Victoria safer. I'd just like to say thank you very much to uh, the Metropolitan Fire Brigade, its members, not just firefighters but 
the broad range of support staff that have assisted during this unprecedented response from the OFB this summer season. Uh, we've been in locations that we've never been before. We've been to Halls Gap and Store, and obviously recently down at the mines uh, in, at Hazelwood in Morwell. And the efforts that have been put in place by our people have been fantastic. And what's been really pleasing is when I've visited those locations, to see a whole range of shirts standing side by side working as one. It's been fantastic. Um, I think it's uh, a sign of more things to come into the future. And I'd like to, again, thank you very much for your efforts this year.